Hi! For this video, we are going to create our DIY electroscope. But, let us first define what an electroscope is. An electroscope is an early scientific instrument invented by William Gilbert. It is used to detect the presence of electric charge on a body. It detects charge by the movement of a test object due to the column electrostatic force in it. The amount of charge on an object is proportional to its voltage. Here are the materials for our DIY electroscope. First, we need a clear jar or any clear container. And make sure to make a hole at the center of the jar's lid. Second, electrical wire. This is where we are going to get the copper wire. For the third one, we need a piece of aluminum foil. We are going to use this for our metal leaves. And lastly, we will use some drawing and cutting tools, also a tape. Let us now create our DIY electroscope. Arat na! For the first step, we are going to create the metal leaves using aluminum foil. We fold the foil into half for us to secure an identical leaf shape out of it. Using a pencil, we are going to make an outline of a leaf structure or just a simple square. Then cut it out. As you can see, it will look like this. Create a hole on top of metal leaves. Make sure to punch it on both sides. Just like this. And then, set aside for a while. For the next step, we are going to take out the copper wire from the electrical wire. This will serve as our metal rod or metal stick. What we are going to do here is to cut the plastic sheath that surrounds our copper wire. We are going to do it on both sides, but make sure to leave a little piece of plastic sheath at the center. The right side should have a longer amount of copper wire while the other side has a shorter amount of copper wire and it should look like this. Twisting the both sides, shape the longer one into spiral form. And for the shorter one, form it into a hook. For the last step, we are now going to put everything together. We have here our jar and make sure to create a hole in the center of the jar's lid. It should be big enough for our metal stick to fit. The spiral form should be located outside. Pass the shorter side through the hole in the jar's lid.
pass it halfway and add some tape at the top to stick them for good. Next is insert our metal limbs into the hook located inside the jar. Close the lid and secure it with a tape. And that's it! We are now done creating our DIY electric bike. Since we are now done in making our DIY electroscope, we are now going to test it to see how it really works. First, we have to select a pair of materials from our Tribal Aesthetics series. And we have here a knitted hat made of cloth and a ruler made of polystyrene. One way to charge an object is through friction. So we are going to rub this together to create friction. When we rub these two materials together, the hat becomes positively charged whereas the ruler becomes negatively charged. Let us watch what happens if we bring this negatively charged ruler near the copper wire. You can see that the leaves are repelling to each other. The closer we bring a charged object, the more they repel. So what's happening here? Another way to charge an object is through induction. And that's what happened here. Induction of course when you have something that's very conductive, like our aluminum, copper wire, and setup. And when you bring another object that's charged close to it. Because our ruler is negatively charged, that's going to repel the electrons that are in the very conductive materials. And since those electrons are loose and free to move, they are all gonna move away from our ruler. Since the leaves are both negatively charged, they try to spread away from each other. So that's it for this video. Make sure to subscribe, like, and share. See you next time for another science episode and hope to learn something from us. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye!